Hello everyone and welcome back to my playthrough of The Wolf Among Us. Last time we went to Prince Lawrence's place and found him just on the brink of death. We found him just in time for him to die. Uh, from what seemed like a self-inflicted wound, and when I mean self-inflicted wound, he put a gun to his head and pulled the trigger. While we were inspecting his apartment, we opened a closet and... A guy burst out of there and started running away. We gave chase and eventually caught up with him. He turned out to be Tweedledee from Alice in Wonderland. You know, the Tweedledee Tweedledum. So he said that he was uh, basically there trying to get information for his employer. Uh, and who was, him, who was his employer? He would not say. And we were about to haul him down to... I was about to say the police station, but I guess just our office to interrogate him when Mr. Tweedledum came up behind us and sucker punched us. Um, Tweedledee did mention that the woodsman who he knew that we were looking for is at the trip trap. So Snow found us while we were on the ground and we called a cab, made our way there. We had a moment of like quiet reflection among ourselves about how Snow feels like she let down the community so far, but, you know, we gave her some encouraging words, and hopefully she'll, you know, do better. And we ended the last episode right, uh, right outside the trip trap. So let's continue right along. I love how he always, like, just fixes his tie, but it ne never really gets fixed. What do you want, Sheriff? Uh, I'm looking for the woodsman. Well, he's not here, so I guess you can go now. Look. I'm not even going to ask where he is now, okay? I just want to know the last time he was here. That's all. Who? I'm being nice. So try again. He hasn't been here for a few weeks. No, maybe. I don't know. But yeah, he hasn't been here in a while, if he's been here at all, which... I don't know. I'd just like some help. I'd just like some help, and I'll be out of here. Well, I'd be willing to help you out of here. Would that help? He a regular? I don't know who you're talking about. The one with the bald head and the beard. Never seen him. A lot of these walk out the door? Yeah, it's called advertising. <laughs> you get a refund? Fuck you. A word's getting out. You'll never guess where I found the other one of these. No, I won't. His place. Whose is that? Someone who left. Then why didn't you dump it? Why didn't you dump it? If you want a cleaner place, Feel free to get the fuck out of here. I'm sensing a very hostile tone from you. Don't deny it. I'm good at picking up on this stuff. Uh, let's grab the chair. Oh, wait, cigarette machine. Uh, okay. Damn. Okay. A 
people out of stools in this place. I don't want to have to yell. If I sit over there, I'm going to have to yell to talk to you. And I don't like raising my voice. Unless I really have to. You're going to order something? Or are you just here to bother my customers? You know what I mean. Give me a Midas gold. You want a lime? No. No. Well, I don't got any anyway. <laughs> Good one. Think that's funny? Yep. Think it's fucking hilarious. It was all right. Come on, guys. I don't want to be here. You don't want me here. The sooner you answer my questions, the sooner I'll be out of your... I wonder who that could be. Holly, you're out of paper towels and the... Saved your beer. Saved your beer for you. Holly wanted to clear it, but uh, I said no. He'll be back. Now here you are. You and me have been going at it for hundreds of years. I'm through fighting. That makes two of us. Well, Woody, that makes two of us. You're in luck. I decided to switch seats. I just want to talk. I just want to talk. This doesn't have to go like this. Maybe he don't want to talk to you. Why don't we let him tell me that? Okay, Grant. Okay, so before we go on, I know a lot of you are probably like, I'm being too soft. Um, I really should like start acting with more authority. I'm the, I'm the sheriff. I'm the appointed sheriff. And I get that. Again, I'm trying to go with like against the stigma of, you know, he's the big bad wolf. He's an asshole. He's a jerk. He's the villain. Why are we entrusting our livelihoods to this, like our protection with this guy? I'm trying to go against that. I'm trying to be as civil as I possibly can. It's going to get to the point where like, I'm going to start drawing a line soon. Like if they keep fucking with me, I'm going to be drawing a line. I'm not going to be like a pushover at like the whole time, but I'm trying that that's, that's what I'm going for. Anyways. <clears throat> it's funny. Just a minute ago, no one seemed to know who you were. Yeah. Well, everyone knows you. Big bad wolf. <laughs> now I'm the bad guy and you're a sheriff. What kind of fucking world is that, huh? Not exactly comfortable with it either, but... Hey. You play the hand you're dealt. Well, some folks are forced to play with shit. That's a lovely image. Guess you want to know about the girl. Amongst other things, sure. I'd walk past her place for weeks. She didn't look like it. But she had money. I was sure of it. But she wouldn't put up any kind of fight. <laughs> I was gonna rob her. 
And the night I finally get up the nerve to do it, there you are, fucking things up for me. You were just in the wrong place at the wrong time. I wasn't there to save her. What are you talking about exactly? Red Riding Hood, her grandmother. I was there to rob him. But when I showed up, you were already there, lying in the bed. I only saved her because I thought she might give me a reward. But she didn't give me shit. Except a bunch of people thinking I'm something I ain't. I played along as long as I could. Only thing I managed to get from it was a free drink every now and again. <laughs> Not a good that did. I already know this story, Woody. You should. You were there. I'm not talking about Red Riding Hood. I'm here about Faith. She was murdered. What? Faith? Who's that? The girl you were beaten on this morning. No, 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 no. I, I was here. I swear. It doesn't look good when a girl you were just smacking around shows up dead hours later. She's dead? Bigby, listen, I, I'm a piece of shit, okay? I know that. I hit that girl, I did. I, I shouldn't have, but I didn't kill her. You believe me, right? They're gonna string me up, Bigby. Like you said, it looks fucking bad. It looks really bad, but I didn't do it. He was here. That's the fucking truth, Sheriff. You see? Bigby, please. Y you can't. They'll throw me down the witching well. That's what they'll do. And I didn't do it. You know that. Hey, stop! This isn't what I want. Oh, shut the fuck up, Woody! Shit ain't just about you. It's about this fucking lapdog. And they come sniffing around this part of town when the rich fucks in the woodlands need a shakedown. Ain't that right, Bigby? Lapdog? Really? Lapdog? Really? Holly's sister goes missing. No one gives two shits about her. Paperwork, waiting rooms, and that bitch Snow White looking right past me, then ushering me out the fucking door. Big mouth. Did anyone tell you you've got a big fucking mouth? Oh, it gets bigger. Oh, good. Should have walked out of here when you had the chance. Come on, you're scaring the lady. Don't worry about me. Oh, here we go.
He's had enough. I'm gonna walk away. Because even though we change into the wolf, I want to show restraint that we're not just an animal. Whiskey. Double. Don't look at me like that. You guys fucking started this. Can we pay for the drink? Shit. It's not like you were going to pay for it anyway. Don't even think about it. Is this the type of treatment I can expect if I let you take me in? They fucking started it, man. Hey, he started it. All right, I got a hundred bucks for the first bloke that can tell me something about a girl name. So go after the woodsman or we go after Tweedledee. Again, getting the meta out of my head. I think it's fairly clear that the woodsman, I think he's innocent. You know, he, he really seems like he's in, he doesn't seem like the kind of person to do something like this. You know, the way it was, like, calmly talking, then he, like, freaked out when he heard that, like, Faith is dead. We found Tweedledee in a fucking... in Lawrence's apartment. Covered in blood. Hiding right after we found Lawrence, like, dying. I'm going after Tweedledee. He obviously knows more than he's letting on, and I'm going to do my best to roll on him. Or get him to roll. You know what I mean. Fuck, man! That's not necessary! Shouldn't have run. Shit. He's the one you want, not me! Your brother won't be saving you this time. Come on. You're under arrest. I told you I didn't do it! And you got nothing to worry about. Anything stupid, and I'll throw you down the witching well myself. It's the woodlands. Oh, shit.
We had something very special. Where's your brother? Fuck you! Give me one good reason I should tell you anything. Siri. I got five. Oh. Oh my. A serial killer? Oh god, and it's one of us? Wait. The woodsman's still walking the streets. We've got to put a lid on this. If you can't manage it, I'll find someone who can. I found out where she's been staying. I know she's here. You must have seen her. What are the two of you hiding? Thanks. Not saying anything. Doesn't matter. Maybe you just want to punch someone. We can arrange that. Uh, what did you do? Uh, friend on friend. At the end of the end. Jesus Christ, baby. Is that you? All right, what a way to whet the appetite for the next episode. Oh, let's see how we did. Did you give Faith your money? You and 84.5% of players gave Faith your money. Did you tell Beast the truth about beauty? You and 59% of players lied and said you hadn't seen beauty. Where did you decide to go first? You and 69.2% of players went to help Toad before Prince Lawrence. What happened to the Prince Lawrence? You did not prevent Prince Lawrence's death. So who's your prime suspect? You and 26.8% percent of players didn't say anything to snow but most people think it was the pimp this is the pimp so uh this is bluebeard we haven't met him yet we haven't met the pimp yet either okay who did you rest when it came down to the wire you and 68.7 percent of players made sure tweedledee didn't get away so we basically are following the same path most people pick um which i mean even this one the prime suspect most people didn't say anything either so we've literally been following down the path most people have been which i don't know i i guess is pretty good for me again trying to stay out of the meta like you know uh, not uh giving into like what i know or what I remember. Okay. So, yeah. So next episode, we'll start right into chapter two and, uh, you know, find out what, okay, actually, before we even do that, before we get to anything, uh, I'm just going to lower the music here. Um, Snow White is is dead. Like, how fucking crazy is that? And, you know, you could say that, like, upon most people who get, like, reflective and, like, go on, like, a monologue like she did in the previous episode usually means they're, like, about to die. But, like, who would have thought? Who would have thought Snow White would have been dead? Like, would be killed off. So early in the game, too. You would think she would have been, like, a main character. Or one of the main characters. But yeah, that's really fucked up. Like, the first time I, I got to this point, my jaw was on the floor. I could not believe I was going. I'm like, this game is hardcore. That's legitimately what I was thinking. Like, it's like Game of Thrones. Like, no one is safe. You know what I mean? Not that it was Game of Thrones at the time, but literally no one is safe. Anyone could fucking die at any point. And that's what I both hate and love about this game. No one is literally safe. But, yeah. Hope you guys had a... <laughs> hope you guys jaw dropped just, mine, just as much as mine did when I first played. But um, yeah, I'm going to be calling it for this episode. Hope you guys 
are excited about uh, about the next chapter. Um, we saw quite a bit, and again, I hope it did whet your appetite for what's to come. Thank you so much for watching, guys, and I will see you in the next one. Take care.